how do you how do you travel? I mean, uh, through if you're going to like different islands or things like that, uh, do you ever find yourself on like canoes and boats, or what are your different modes of travel throughout the years? Well, uh, here in Luzon, uh, I uh, I am in the province of Bataan. Uh, there are many provi- provinces here. Mm-hmm. Uh, we have very old car. And uh, we use it for uh, traveling and dis- distributing uh, to the other provinces. But uh, most of the boxes who are uh, Cebuanos dialects, mm-hmm. uh, who are uh, in the southern part of the Philippines, we mm-hmm. ship them or we, we mail them. Okay. We mail them. Okay. So once you get a container in country, you're able to mail mail them to different regions, which sounds yeah. very, uh, yeah, that sounds like a very uh, wise way to do it, sure. Especially in the southern part of the Philippines where uh, mm-hmm. our countries are uh, mostly, our uh, uh, countrymen are mostly Muslims. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There are Muslims there, mm-hmm. the southern Philippines. Sure, sure. So there's, I tell you, our, um, with the Arabic, um, and I don't know if they, they probably don't speak Arabic there, but uh, yeah. we have no, a wonderful no, no. Arabic Gospel of John. Yeah. They, they speak Cebuanos, and we have that, uh, we have that uh, scripture booklet, Cebuanos Great. dialect. It's Great. It's a language here in the Philippines. Okay, wonderful. And then I'm, and then I'm guessing then, then your, uh, other distributors, people who who get the uh, the materials from you, they are going way out into the highways and hedges, and probably using uh, various modes of transportation and yeah, canoes and boats and whatever to get them to various villages and such. Mm, yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Very, very good. That is that is so. Uh, it's just so interesting and uh, and amazing. So what is um. I mean, what's your vision for the Philippines? What is what is what is your prayer? What is your goal? What can our listeners and viewers be praying with you about uh, as we're coming out of this pandemic? Uh, how can we be agreeing with you? Mm. Well, uh, we are looking for more of this scripture booklet, especially this uh, this uh, pandemic time, and uh, we are. Uh, Praying for uh, more souls to be win more Filipinos, more of our countrymen uh, to know Jesus through the scripture mm-hmm. booklets. Yes, yes, amazing. And has there been any any word on when the uh, your next shipment's coming? Alison said uh, this uh, December uh, twenty five. Oh, December twenty five today here in the Philippines. He said uh, they are planning to ship uh, a container, two containers mm-hmm. uh, for the Philippines. Okay, yeah, it's it's February 24th here, but it's February, it's the 25th there? 25th here. Tomorrow. Yeah, because you're... Because you're you're in the yeah you're in the morning I'm in the evening it was when we started this conversation it was nine p nine a.m. there and nine p.m. here so eight p.m. here so yeah we really have to coordinate that when we do it well oh so you should be receiving your shipment shortly yes yes and we are excited many pastors are yes. waiting for that shipment. Yes, yes. Well, I, I thought so. I thought I had I had sent out a prayer request. Yeah, and and yeah, for the Philippines. And so, people, uh, Renee, this is kind of a neat thing. We have um, when we know that there's a shipment going out, and yours is included in that. But uh, we send out a prayer request to the radio stations, and so we have all of these listeners through the radio stations, and those that listen to the podcast as well watch the videos and uh, and read our newsletters, you know, they're praying for you and for the people in the Philippines. So I find that uh, it's such a blessing to be able to do that and to support you because without people like you, it's just what we're doing here is, you know, is ink, paper and staples. So when we hear the testimonies and when uh, we see how delighted you are to be, you know, receiving 
this shipment. Uh, that really, it blesses us so much. So, you know, I look forward to uh, the fruit of this shipment and hearing the testimonies. And if you can get any pictures for me, that would be uh, that would be wonderful. You know, any pictures, videos, uh, stories, anything that you have, we'd love to share that with the uh, with the ambassador network because I know that would uh, bless a lot of people. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yes. From time to time, I'm sending uh, a picture to your page, uh, World Missionary Press. Mm -hmm. You have a page, World Missionary Press, in Facebook. Yes. And I'm sending yes. some uh, yes. photos of testimonies. Yes. That it's wonderful. That is that is absolutely wonderful, and we do we do appreciate that, and we love to be able to support you and to let uh, Christ work through you, uh, be known in the earth with our with, with 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 the voice and the platform that we have. So it's wonderful when the body of Christ worldwide, when we can join together uh, in this type of of an effort. And again, we we do appreciate you so much, all that uh, that you're doing there. A pastor happened to to happen to he, he went in our uh, warehouse and uh, he found out the scripture uh, booklets entitled uh, who who am I uh, no no no, no. Mm -hmm. uh, the way to God the way to God okay he said he was saved by that uh, particular uh, scripture booklets. Uh, when he was still uh, a, a young pastor in college. Oh. Mm. You know, today, he was, uh, he, he, he have uh, 32 churches and uh, wow. 32 pastors under him. Wow. And he always shared that uh, he was, uh, he knew the Lord, he knew the Lord through that scripture booklets. The way mm. That's amazing. And he, he saw the booklet while he was in school. Is that right? Yes, yes. At the, yes. Uh, at the table, table of his co-teachers. Co -teacher. Oh, wow. Okay. And the he, booklets and read it. And he, he discovered, <laughs> read it, discovered uh, Jesus' love for him and for mankind and and now, yeah, 32 churches later, that's pretty amazing. That's a, that's a wonderful thing. And that's just one booklet. That's just one booklet uh, just reaches, can reach so, so many people. And you never know who you're handing one to, do you, really? Yes, so that's, that's amazing. I remember uh, when he discovered our warehouse, uh, he's, he, he returned and uh, bring three cars to to load it with boxes of uh, scripture uh, booklets. Uh -huh. He was so happy he found out our warehouse here mm -hmm. in our project. Wow. You know, it's amazing. And people need to know this, you know, when, when we're sending containers and when they you know, when they go places, it's not like, you know, it, the people on the other end, they have plans for the booklets. So many of them are already spoken for and, <laughs> and they're gone, you know, in, in no time. I mean, it, it, there's, there's always, it seems there's just so much strategy that's put into place and a, um, an enthusiasm and, and just wonderful expectation, um, and faith and hope, um, that they have, you know, the, in prayer and uh, just seeking the Lord, you know, uh, contemplatively. And uh, it, it just, it amazes me because it's like once, once it hits the ground, once that ship comes in and, and the yeah. boxes come, uh, people are already excited. They've been excited for months, you know, and then they're, they're so excited to receive them and to share them. And then the plans get to, uh, you know, come to, uh, come to fruition. And that's really a neat thing. Before we close, if what I'd like, to, if if you'd like to address, I'll give you the floor. If you would like to address our our staff, our President Harold Mack, our our staff at World Missionary Press, our volunteers, um, our prayer partners and donors, what would you like to what would you like to tell them at this time? Uh, first of all, I want to give uh, thanks to all of you there. Uh, you know, of all the countries in the world, uh, 
I'm so overwhelmed that you chose the Philippines uh, for uh, three decade, three decades now to uh, to uh, evangelize, to be a part, to be our partner in uh, evangelizing this uh, third world country. You know, the Philippines is, uh, is still a poor country today, mm -hmm. and uh, we need uh, to give hope to these uh, poor people. Uh, mm -hmm. and uh, share Jesus with them. I thank Harold and Helen Williams, also Alison, and uh, all of you there. You are doing a great job, and uh, I'm sure uh, you have a great reward in heaven when the Lord comes. <laughs> Oh, praise praise the Lord. He is He is good. Yes, one plants, one waters, but God gives the increase. You know, so it's a it's it's a beautiful thing. And thank you, thank you so much. Uh, so would you would you like to close us in prayer um, for uh, for the Philippines and uh, and for World Missionary Press? If you would uh, do us that honor, we would we would love that. Thank you, thank you, uh, brother Joe. I appreciate you also. This. Uh morning here and and uh i love you and, uh, love you too I, I i i'm so uh, uh overwhelmed this morning my beauty my morning is very beautiful because of this uh interview uh thank you so much and uh, praise the lord yes thank you also that you that i can contact you anytime mm -hmm. and uh I, I i let you know when, uh, when really? I have a, when we have a need here, especially regarding scripture booklets. Mm -hmm. Amen. Okay. Amen. Okay, let oh, us pray. Let's do that. Oh, Father God, we thank you for this uh, wonderful time that you gave to us. Thank you, Father God, that you always provide our needs, especially uh, for uh, this uh, tools for evangelism, the scripture booklets that World Visionary Press is using. And uh, we also, I also thank you for uh, Harold Mack, Helen Williams, Allison, and all of the staff there and volunteers. Please continue, Father, to, to guide them. Give them a good health and wisdom. Protect them always. And we pray when we ask for more of your uh, uh, financial uh, support for this uh, wonderful ministry that is running for more than many decades. Uh, you use World Missionary Press not only in America but also in the Philippines and many countries in the world. And Father, we are looking forward uh, that uh, you continue to supply all the needs of this uh, wonderful ministry. Bless this wonderful people that you use, mm -hmm. Father God and uh, continue to bless them and uh, uh, fill their hearts with uh, passion and joy because uh, we know that uh, our works is uh, pleasing in your uh, sight. Thank you, Father God. We ask this in, uh, Je in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Amen. Thank you so much, brother. All Thank right. You, much, yes, much love to you and, and your family and to all our listeners, viewers. God bless you. We, we love you so much. Thanks for tuning in. It's, it's been wonderful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> bless you, my brother. Thank you. Thank you.